Has your car insurer been awarded best value car insurer in New South Wales? NRMA Insurance has. Does your car insurer offer great prices? NRMA Insurance does. So unless your car takes care of itself, it's time to get a better deal. Others, driven by instincts of their own, are waiting. John West endures the worst. Shane! Shane Deeks! Down here! Go! Because we can. <laughs> Greg, on to you. Which ancient city lies on the border of both the Asian and European continents? Istanbul. Yeah, I'm sorry, I did say ancient city. Yeah, sure, now it's called that, but we needed Constantinople. The price is wrong, bitch! It's Hudson, a typical modern biking. Violent, erratic. Hudson had a liking for the nightlife and the drugs that went with it. By the time he lost the plot in this Sydney strip club, Hudson had convictions for assault, violence and fraud. We believe that he came across a member of another bikey gang with whom he had some form of disagreement. He waited for him. And next thing you know, he shot him. He was a dangerous man of extremes. <laughs> After a booze and drug fueled night, Hudson exploded again. At a time when most people were heading off to work, Hudson was heading home. The fuck was that shit? <laughs> Hudson had already savagely attacked one woman, <laughs> throwing her into the street and kicking her head in. She was taken to hospital while Hudson waited on King Street for his girlfriend, Kira Douglas. He then dragged Douglas, at gunpoint, into the car park. She escaped and Hudson chased her into Flinders Lane, grabbing her as she went to get into a cab. Two passers-by came to her aid and Hudson shot them. He shot Paul DeWard, then Kira Douglas, then Brendan Keeler. Then he shot the two men again. He stopped when the gun was empty. We didn't specify the ramps or the Van Mario, so suck shit. Okay, now the bet is that Mike can't make it over this man without even killing himself? Right, are you ready? Ready!
Thank you, Mr. Beck. He's clean. They've disposed of the setup fee. You're a local, right? Yeah, I've um, lived there my whole life. You know, I, uh, I dug this up and um, somehow I feel like it belongs to you. I just need to stay a little bit longer. Can I just stay a little bit longer? I can't do this. I'm not lying when I say there's something else. Energy can't be destroyed, right? I have to go. Lucinda. Once, there was nothing but this. At night, everybody would have come back to the campfire to reconnect with the landscapes around them. We need to find that other place. Hey, any problems? No. Mm. 